Hi, and welcome to Moo Moo Math. Today we're going to look at how to find the surface area of a pyramid. Okay, what's a pyramid? A pyramid is a three-dimensional figure with a base and an apex. And um, here is a square pyramid, and a pyramid is named by the shape of the base. Okay, we're going to look at surface area, and surface area is the uh, material needed to make it. Let's say this is cardboard. It would be the cardboard it would take to make the sides and to make the base all together. So we're going to take this pyramid and kind of divide it up. Okay, the face of each side of that pyramid is a triangle and the base of the pyramid is a square. So I've separated those out. Now to find the surface area, I have to look at this figure and I think, well, I have four sides, so I have four triangles. So if I can find the area of the triangle, I can multiply it by four, and then I'm going to add just one base to it. So I only have one base to add to it. So let's take and isolate this triangle for a second. Okay, the triangle has a side, a base of six, and we need this height down the center of this face because that's the height of that triangle. That height is called the slant height. Now to find the slant height, I'm actually going to use the Pythagorean theorem. So I, inside of this pyramid, I have a right triangle. Right here is my right angle, and it actually is half of this face, isn't it? So if this is half of the face, if the whole side is six, this part is three. My height inside is going to be um, four, and then I'm going to solve it, whoops, inside of here, three, and then I'm going to solve four, and I'm going to use the Pythagorean theorem to find this slant height right here. To find that slant height, I'm going to use three squared plus four squared is equal to c squared. So 25 is equal to c squared, and so c is five. So that means my slant height is actually five but that actually was generated from the height inside that pyramid. So my height is five, and that's the slant height. Okay, I no longer need the three over here because I've used it to find the slant height. Now I'm gonna find the area of this triangle. The area of the triangle is one half, the base times the height. Well, our base is six, and our height is five, so one half of six times five, that's 30, half of 30 is 15. Now remember, I have four of these triangles, don't I? Don't I? One on each side of the pyramid. So I'm gonna multiply that by four. So the surface area of just the sides, which is called the lateral area, is 60 square units. Now I'm gonna add one base. Okay, the base, remember, is a square that is six by six or 36 so uh, square units. So I'm going to add 36 to that and add those together and that gives me 96 square units. And there you go. That is how you find the surface area of a pyramid. So here we go. We take the area of one face, we multiply it by the number of faces and that gives us our lateral area. Then we add one base to it to get the whole surface area. And I hope this video was helpful for you to figure out the surface area of a pyramid.